We pause again here to light another candle. But what good can this tiny little fragile flame do against a world of darkness? And yet still we watch it, quietly, shining, not adding to the angst or the anger, not condemning or condoning the voices of violence, the tools of terror, the weapons of war, but simply standing still, shining, pure, somehow a simple sign of peace in troubled times. As we light this flame, it's just one of many that will be lit today, in many different places, in very different cultures, but one journey, one story, one hope. Like the stars scattered right across the sky, so too these little lights pierce the darkness, pointing the way to the one whose peace will know no end. The one true light, whose glow and grace we offer to the nations. Like this flame in the darkness, we keep this light burning, we keep this hope living, we keep this song spreading. Glory to God in the highest heavens and peace to all on earth. For all those places where conflict scars still mark the landscape. For all the once busy streets now emptied out by force and fear. For all the heaps of ash and rubble where hope and hope once stood. Lord, let your peace pervade like morning mist, changing anger's atmosphere. For all the families fleeing from terror, threat and treachery. For relationships rips apart by invisible battle lines of strife. For all those whose eyes still skin with the bitter tears of grief. Lord, let your peace spring up like a secret seed surprising death is life. For all whose feet are asked to march to the rhythm of duty and sacrifice. For all whose hands are asked to carry the capacity to climb a life. For all whose eyes are asked to see the sights of such suffering and sadness. Lord, let your peace heal the hidden hearts in body, soul and mind. For all the minds where hatred's noise still drowns and deafens. For all the memories bruised and battered by prejudice and pain. For all the dreams haunted by the cause of crisis past. Lord, let your peace source the seeping wounds of searing hurt and shame. For the part we can all play in passing on and amplifying pain. For the ways we work to weaponize our words, worries and our ways. For the lines we draw, the names we call, the walls we build, the camps we form. Lord, let your peace come, come and cleanse us, till we glow with glimmers of grace. For you came preaching perfect peace to people near and far. And you soup down so low to reach us, from highest throne to manger bed. You saw us at our very worst and chose to show us grace. So, Lord, let your peace so direct and define us till you are seen in us again. In Jesus' name, Amen. <laughs>